Good morning everyone. Welcome to another week as it is Monday morning and I think there is no better way of starting a week than a diecast review video, is it? So, maybe not very surprisingly, I am going to review this model card I had for a few weeks by now, but I haven't reviewed it yet. I think it's perfect timing because uh, Max just won the Grand Prix, the second Grand Prix of the year yesterday in Saudi Arabia. And uh, I think that was a brilliant drive from him, both from him and Charles Leclerc. It was an awesome race, I think we can agree on that. So, um, yeah, I just thought uh, it's good timing for uh, for this one. So this is the winner, the Dutch Grand Prix winner, Max Verstappen RB16B from last year, from Spark. And, um, yeah, I... I ended up selling the other one. I made a video earlier about the Monaco Grand Prix winner. I, I ended up selling that to replace it with this one. And this is uh, a bit better in quality. I mentioned a few things about that other one that I didn't like. So I ended up selling that as I had this one on pre-order anyway. And I quite like this. Uh, Spark don't normally do this, but they just recently started. The background is like the the crowd from the from the Dutch Grand Prix the orange army so it's like just like a little extra detail from Spark I quite like that I hope they're gonna keep this um, thing anyway let's see the model itself I just literally opened it I still got the the foil next to me I just taken it off this is coming with a pit board as well which I can't remember if the Monaco winner had a pit board or not. Well, anyway, this one has got the board. And Max Verstappen said that this is one of his best Grand Prix victories ever. So I'm quite happy to replace the Monaco winner with this one. Also, again, because it's a spotless one. So I recently had some issues with Spark with the front wing slightly off to that side which is like it was a bit weird because it was not on the on the right spot where it should have been now on this one it's absolutely spot on as you guys can see it and um, it's always quite quite highly detailed so I'm not gonna say the usual things that I always say in every video blah blah front wing and barge boards yes they are quite nice just as they should be but um, what I actually I just noticed the front wing is a little bit quite high up like normally it's a bit closer to the floor it's almost halfway through compared to the like if you see the front wheel it's almost like halfway through there but anyway it's it's not really the end of the world what uh, what i'm quite happy about is that on the monaco grand prix version i had a, a bit of an issue with that rug sticker and also there are two tiny little stickers those green ones just right where my nail is on the on the mirror holder those thingies they were like slightly peeling off same as um just just like the sorry the honda logo over there they were slightly peeling off as well on the on the other one and also which really bothered me the end of the the tail of the bow was like slightly hanging off from the model and i saw that with like not not saying almost every first step in models, but quite a lot of them being stickered like um well, not so well <laughs> to put it like that, but on this one, that one is just spot on as well. they correctly positioned uh, I don't know what's wrong with my camera. it's not focusing properly, sorry, I'll just clean it quickly now, I think that's a bit better now, so um yeah the number 33 is correctly positioned on this one as well so um yeah really happy about it and um 
don't know what else to say about it really it's it's pretty much what you see that's what you get if you order the dodge ground Prix winner max verstappen rb16b red bull um yeah a little bit more about yesterday's race i think it was a really really good one and hopefully we're gonna see a few more races like this uh, where we can uh, actually until the last lap it, it wasn't decided who's gonna win so it was really good really nice uh, job done by leclerc just like by max perez was a bit unfortunate unfortunately he he couldn't win his um, race where he achieved his first ever pole position but never mind, I think he's still got a chance to win a few races this year. It looks like he's a lot closer to Max this year than he was last year. So, yeah. Um, a bit more details. I tried to show the car a little bit closer. Yeah, that, that's it pretty much. Really nice model car. Uh, thanks for pitlanemodelshop.com as always. <laughs> And I think that's it for now. Have a good week, everyone. See you later, guys.